Okay, here we go. Insight. Play. I don't know anything about this, by the way. Just so you guys know. I showed it came out today. It is a horror story game. We're walking down particularly small roads. Left or right. The left side drew me. Like I just, it was my instinct to go left. You should always follow your instincts. Shh, quiet, Steam. Carl first. Choose left. Oh, dead body. Carl. Amy, no, 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 this can't be real. Oh no, I couldn't, I couldn't have done this. I couldn't have. Oh, I killed her? What? I do. Did I do? I? Killer? How do I get up? How do I? Can I not press anything? I can't press anything. Okay, I clicked it. Amy, I'm sorry, but. <gasps> Oh my gosh, that starts off so aggressive. I have to get to a place where I can see myself. You just took her eyeballs? Her pretty green eyeballs? That's a large picture of us making out. Okay, I don't think I can go... Can I? Go in the door? Lots of orbs floating around. That's a terrible picture of a cat. Carl. Amy. Oh, I, it's me talking. What? Hello? It's just me blinking? These are not real. None of these is real. What? This isn't real? It's supposed to all be fake? There's like... I hate the blinking. What are the controls? Like, can I get out of here? What can I do with the knife? Okay, I have to like look directly at the door handle to open the door. What is that? Oh, it's <laughs> I thought it was theater seats. Got it. Interesting layout for a house. I am I solving the mystery? Okay, so that's old. I don't know what that says. Is there any other doors I can go in? So that's what I'm doing, right? I'm solving the mystery of like who killed her? Amy, no, no, Amy, I couldn't have done this. Just over and over repeating yourself. Interesting. Well, you sure did. Maybe we should wash our hands. Yeah. <gasps> what the f What did I click? Oh my god. What the hell? Did I just put her eyeball- <gasps> No. I don't like this at all. I don't like it at all. And I don't like it at all. Oh my god. What? And now I'm her? Should I go upstairs and see if like that body's- if my body's still there? Amy, Amy, are you home? Oh, this is how it happened. Amy, are you here? Am I being hunted right now? I should go upstairs, right? Because he's trying to see what happened through her eyes. Are you upstairs? Yes? Are you? Amy, are you in the bathroom? 
No. Are you? Where do I go? Where is he? What do I do? Do I go in this bathroom? Amy? But, but why am I seeing you? What the f in the mind fuckery is this? You need to follow the doors. That one kills me? Did he just kill me? Okay, so now we need to go right. I'm assuming. Okay. This is such a trip. Like, this is literally just trippy. Okay, now Robert. Oh, fuck. Oh? Carl? Oh, because he finds him. With his eyeballs stabbed out. Oh. My lanta- What? What? No, 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 no! Hi! No! Carl? Oh, look at me. This is no time for jokes, but... I look like Harry Potter and Zorro had a baby. Anyways, let's go solve the murder. <laughs> no! Should I run? Stop. Don't come anymore. Can't help it. <laughs> no, what? What am I supposed to do? Carl. Other ways for me to go. Carl? Run! Run! Get away! Stop! Stop stabbing me, lady! I take the... I just keep doing it? She's mad at me. Is she the real killer? No, she was dead. And she's got no eyeballs. Is this is like Groundhog Day? I think I'm supposed to. S I think it's because. She okay, 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 okay. So she can't see. She has no eyeballs. So if I'm just quiet, it's like a we're like a T Rex. Nice. Okay, we're like a T Rex. Is she still there? No. <sighs> She was right there, dude. Okay. Where am I supposed to go? I'm supposed to get out of here, right? Oh. Oh my god, I the shit. What else is in here? that pictures there's all kinds of pieces of paper i wonder what they mean or if they are anything probably not damn it no such luck oh for you what I reach you. Do I need a key? Phone. I'll call her. TV. Hmm. 
I don't know. I don't like this. Is she just getting ready to stab me again? In which case, I'm not interested. Okay, well, there's him again. Hey, he must have it. Ah, uh, the key. Was it upstairs? Yeah, it was upstairs, because I was like, oh, it's locked. Okay. This is so trippy. There she is. Hello? Lady? With the ugly haircut. Should I surprise her? Oh! Oh! She got me. Again. Is she smelling me? Is she kissing me? What the f Huh? Um. Police line. Do not cross. Well, I'll be crossing it anyways. Welcome, detect- Oh, I'm a detective. Arrived here approximately an hour ago based on the report from the nearby residents who heard a gunshot. There was no guns, it was all knives. We found two corpses during the search of the house, and we are quite confident these incidents are murders. Now, please follow me. Oh, that's a lot of writing. Is that the end? Can't be. This way, detective. This way, detective. Fuck. That appears to be a suicide, sir. Oh, now- Oh, now look at me all sexy. Carl Hickson, U.S. citizen, 32 years old, married to Amy Hickson, graduate of Dunwich University of Psychiatry. That's interesting. He'd been working in Linchester Hospital for about three years, but I had to quit seven months ago because one of his patients has had a fit of anger and attacked Carl, causing enough damage to make him lose both his eyes. After this incident, he quit working. I understand. Have you informed Amy? We're trying to reach Amy... Hickson, but have not been able to contact her in any way yet. Okay, so she is the murderer. You mentioned that the neighbors heard a gunshot, but these deaths seem to have occurred with a knife. Yes, if you wish to content or er, content. Oh, there's one more thing. What is it? Twelve days ago, a missing person report was filed for Carl Hickson by Amy Hickson, and now he's here in his house, dead. Hmm. Let's continue, shall we? The other body's upstairs in the house. We are upstairs. We know we're not upstairs. Bad, I have bad memory of the layout of this house. That's okay. Ah. Uh, interesting that Amy was the first one that we found dead. But now she's not even dead. Robert West, U.S. citizen, 34 years old, single graduate of Dunwich University Medical School. I, here's my theory before we move on. I think that she thought she was going to get murdered. And she went cuckoo crazy, bananas, and killed him first. Hmm. And then he found out, and then she killed him. After graduating from University of Love for United States, South Asia, came to the local hospital. However, he was fired shortly afterwards by the hospital administration. Why? We haven't learned the reason, but we are trying to contact the hospital administration. Did Robert and Carl, Carl, did Robert and Carl have met in university? Yes, they participated in common activities during their time. Whatever. Similarly, Amy also graduated there. Shortly after graduating, she married Carl. Got it, got it. Seems that both deaths occurred due to blows from the same, same knife. Oh, that is cross-contamination. Our team will start working and collecting samples for DNA tests shortly. They will be able to determine whose blood and fingerprints are on the knife. You mentioned that Carl had to quit his job because he lost vision. Have you been able to obtain any information from the hospital about the extent of the damage? He lost his vision. According to the information we received, he falls into the legally blind category. Do you have any information about why Robert said this house? Can't say anything definitive at the moment. We found a doctor's bag in the bedroom. Expect that the owner of the bag was Robert West. So he got called because Carl stabbed. It'd be a good idea to check the phone records. We need to access Carl's medical, medical resident register. Yep, yeah, find it. This is a lot of talking. I'll get you the DNA test results. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. I'll leave the house after looking around a bit. 
Let's go look around. Oh, where the hell did you come from? Okay, medical bag. What's in here? Bag belongs to Robert. Just mean that Robert was in this house to treat Carl. Ah, yeah, you're a fucking genius. You shouldn't be touching that. What's this? Whatever happened between Carl and Robert seems to have started here. Oh, why was there a gun? That doesn't make any fuck of this. Bye. Same knife, but... What? Robert's blood dripping through the crack in the ceiling. That is disgusting. Shade of red seems different from what I've seen before. Well, what do you think is a vampire? Anything in here? Plates and glasses are completely covered in dust as if Amy hasn't been home for a while and there's a missing person report out for Carl. Wonder why Amy or I wonder where Amy is. Be good to reach her as soon as possible. She's probably fleeing the scene. She is crazy. She is Cuckoo bananas, am I right? What the hell's wrong with you? Oh, do you have just have a white beard? Good evening, detective. Good evening. Okay, I don't want to talk to you guys anyways. Okay, what else is there to find? What else? What else? Yes, oh, hmm. What? 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 Can I open this? Can I look around? Why is there stuff on the floor? What are these notes? What's in here? Oh, there's... What is this? Page been torn with a notebook. Whoa, 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 there's a lot of stuff happening. Oh, there's also a pencil right there. Yeah, which means they probably... Just like a suicide note? Excuse me, sir. I'm the detective here. Okay. Pictures are dusty like the rest of the house. Carl and Amy look very happy in the photos. Well, now he's got a knife in the eyeball, so... I'll tell you, pictures are dusty. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dusty, musty, crusty. Can I leave? Whoa, this is trippy as shit. Uh oh. Oh. I accidentally left. Wait, September 24th. Wait. This is before. Wait, what? Where am I? Dear? Who am I? What's going on? Wait, this is before, right? It was October 4th or something? So this is like a week before. Two weeks before? I don't care. I'll just get wet. I can't see with the damn umbrella on. They're just running aside me? Aside me? They're just running beside me? A free spirit. Just like me. Is that somebody's Patronus? Is this Harry Potter? Where am I? <laughs> What's going on? Hello? Knock, knock. Okay. There he is. Stevie Wonder. What a long walk. Hey, buddy. Carl? Hey, Robert. Okay, so I'm Robert now. Hey, what are you doing here? Are you alone? Yeah, I'm alone. I realized that I haven't talked to my friend for a long time and wanted to drop by. Yeah, come. Let me help you. We can talk inside the house. He's at my house. This is my house now? I need, like, a map. Why am I holding on to him? He's blind. Can I just run him into a wall over and over? Bonk. Bonk. Trust me, bro. Bonk. It's funny. Sit down. He looks so antsy. Is it always rainy around here? Yeah, it would be a good idea to take an umbrella with you. Finding this place was quite difficult. It seems like you put in a lot of effort to, to hide from people. Huh. <sighs> Although, even when we're in... Wait, when we were in college, you didn't like being in crowded places. I usually prefer quiet places. Well, why did you put so much effort into finding this place, Carl? I wanted to pay you a visit. Why? I'll tell you the reason for my visit. You see my condition, Robert. I'd like... I'm like buried in darkness, right? Fine. I'm about to collapse, and I don't have the strength to endure this anymore. I came here with the hope that you could be the solution for me. 
solution. I want you to give me a pair of eyes, Robert. I don't understand. There's nothing done. There's nothing to not understand. I want two eyes. I want to be able to see again, Robert. This is not possible. You must know that it's not possible, Carl. And why are you asking such a thing for me? How did you even come up with the idea that I could be a solution to this? Come on, Robert. I think I don't know what why you went to South Asia after graduating college. You graduated here with top honors. You could have entered anywhere you wanted, but you decided to go to the other side of the world, into one of the most crowded places in the world. What was a man who doesn't like crowds doing in such a place, Robert? Do you think I couldn't guess the experiments you were conducting? Do you think I don't know that you're using the poor people there as a test subject? Of all the things you've done, transplanting a pair of eyes to the blind person must be a piece of cake. What do you want this? For Amy, Robert. For Amy! When we were in university, you were our closest friend. You know how much we loved each other. Now I can't even see her. Sometimes, sometimes I feel like I've lost her. As if, as if every moment I can't see her, she's also ignoring me. Sounds like you need therapy. As an old friend, all I ask is, all I ask of you is to transplant a pair of eyes to me. For Amy, do you understand? Yes, I understand. No, no, you can't understand. You can't understand the longing I feel for Amy. All right, first of all, you need to fully realize what you're asking for. You're asking for a new pair of eyes for me. But for me to give you that, I need to take someone else's eye. Do you understand what this means? I have to end someone's life. It doesn't matter to me. But can you live with this guilt? Why does it not matter to me? <laughs> I want the eyes, okay. All right, then, in the name of our old friendship, I'll do it. But during this time, you must stay here under my control. Also, I need to examine the damage to your eyeballs first and perform necessary cleanings inside the eyelid. If you're ready, let's go downstairs to my laboratory. What? Right now? Yeah, I thought you wouldn't want to waste any more time. Or are you not sure about wanting to do this, huh, pussy? No, oh. I mean, yes, yeah, yeah, I'm sure. You have a laboratory underneath your house? It only makes me think of Dexter's laboratory. I'm so sorry. Come on, come with me. Let's go, buddy. Oh, God, I'm him? Oh, God. Oh, I'm a blind person. You could lead me better, perhaps. Getting seasick. This is interesting, going from different... Like, from person to person. Oh, what the fuck? The hell is this smell? I wish it did. <gasps> oh my god. Okay. Oh. Let's get the syringe. Oh. What the fuck? This is disgusting. Gotta get the syringe. Ew, ew, ew. Oh my god. This is not sanitary, bro. Not even a little bit. Administering anesthesia now after cleaning around your eyes. I'll transplant the suitable eyes I found for you. And when you wake up, you'll be able to see. Oh. I hate shit like this. <laughs> Disgusting, bro. <laughs> Hello? So this is three days later, right? Up from the transfer procedure this night, and the vital signs such as a body temperature, pulse, and blood pressure are optimal. There hasn't been any weight loss, night sweats, or fever. No rash or sensory loss has been observed on the skin. Reflexes are responding perfectly, and consciousness is still okay. This is a day before the murders. I can't always stay at home. Sometimes I go out for hunting, and there are days where I need to go shopping. I'll stay by your side as much as possible, but if you ever want to leave from here, the door code is 1890. Oh, God. 1890. Are you there? Yeah, Carl, I'm here. It's too early for you to wake up. You need to rest for a few more days. Wait, when the hell do I kill? I don't remember. Ah, the bandages are off. This is incredible, Robert. No amount of things can express how grateful I am. Robert, hundreds of times, thousands of times. Let's make out. 
I can imagine what this means for a for me to see Amy again. And he's gonna have taken he took the eyeballs from Amy, right? Right. That's why she took out the missing persons report, though. Maybe not. Here my personal phone number is written on the card. Do you hear my any side effects? Or experience any side effects, call me. Thank you, Robert. Thank you. Into the light. Go. Okay. This is like that scene in Harry Potter. Amy, Amy, are you home? Amy, are you upstairs? I wonder where you are. Amy. Nice boobs. She's probably in the bathroom, right? I forgot which door goes to what. Amy? Yeah, honey, are you in the bathroom? She's obviously not in the bathroom. What in the... I've been left here for some... Oh, she's just not here. There's the knife. Foreshadowing. Maybe I should grab the knife before I can get killed. It's for sure a self-inflicted wound, though. Right? Amy? Better go to the living room and call her on the phone. Okay, yeah, that I knew that. Okay. Phone is unreachable. Amy, I miss hearing your voice. I miss seeing your face so much. Clingy, needy. She's not realizing that. I haven't seen myself in a long time either. Let's go look in the mirror. I look right now. Narcissist. There's pictures of you everywhere, but let's go. I love the long, slow blinks, too. A bit different. Bright green eyes. Is this? Is this me? I look weird. These eyes. Why do they look so familiar? I knew it. I told you. These, these eyes, Amy. Oh no, 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 no! This can't be real. Well, it's fucking real. I'm crazy. I'm crazy. This is this is crazy. This is madness. Madness. Robert. That's when I called Robert. He can't have done this. No, 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 no! This can't be real. Robert, I have to call Robert. Oh gosh, I'm over to go. Amy, something couldn't have happened to Amy. Amy. Oh, what have you done? Why am I drunk? Oh god, hello? Running into walls. Excuse me. Robert. I knew it. I knew that that was what happened. I guess I think there's... A bleeding in my left eye? Um, it's itching bad. I wonder, I wonder, could you come take a look? Oh, so I'm plotting revenge. What exactly happened to your eye? Do you feel stinging? I, I don't know. Okay, I'll be there in a few hours. I will kill you, you bastard. But how? To the knife! How, 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 knife? I need a knife. I will kill you, you bastard. What the fuck is the kitchen? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get sick. This will do. Carl? Oh no, what am I doing? I... I can't kill anyone. But Amy, Amy already died because of me. I killed Amy. Blood on my hands again. First of all, one last thing. Wait, first of all, one last thing. One last note. Was it in here? I think it was. Oh, 
Where is the note writing stuff? Oh, note writing. Pencil, paper. Well, it was right here. I don't want to accidentally go all the way upstairs if I don't have to. Where do I go? Ugh. That was just a hiccup. Okay, let's go find the pen and paper. What? No. Wait, am I gonna... I'm confused. Okay, great. A notebook and pencil in the bath. Or in the bedroom. In the bedroom. Perfect. Thank you. Who knows what he's hiding in this house? Those sickening smells. Oh, in his house. Whatever. Okay, yeah. I can go to the table and write my last note. Yeah, I have to go to the table. Of course, nice boobs. Again? Respectfully? Password of the door? He said it while my eyes were bandaged. It was 1890. I remember it. I still don't remember the layout of this house, though, because it's stupid. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. 18. No, no, no. It was 1890. Nine zero. Did it wrong. Must hide this note. I thought it was one eight nine zero. Where should we hide the note? In a plant. Why would I hide the note? In there. In the pocket of that. No, okay. Should we hide it upstairs? Should we hide it under the bed? Under the covers, in there, in the bathroom. Okay. Amongst the clothing, in the plants thing. In the what the hell? Oh wait. Okay. Oh, there he is. Must be Amy. It's not Amy. It's this guy. Hey. How do you feel? Something happened? You look very pale. Come, come. Let's go upstairs. You can treat me there. Yeah, come on. Come upstairs. I don't have a knife. Yes, oh-ho. Uh -huh. Quite, quite. Come on. Come on, my good sir. Oh, wow. Yes, you may set this down right there. Um... I'm just. Oh, he has a gun. Oh! What have you done, son of a bitch? I just did what you asked of me. Wait, why did he have a gun? Whose eyes are like these? Whose? Mm. What? September 27th, we go backwards. The flip. So confused. Oh, now I'm Amy. Carl, let it be Carl. Carl. Carl's missing. Oh God. Car Robert. Hi, Amy. This is a good time for a visit. Not really. What do you want? Not the one asking for anything from you. You could be sure of that. Guess you're not going to invite me in. We haven't seen each other since university. Why did you come now? Okay then. Recently, Carl came to visit me. Carl? Where is he? What did you do to him? I haven't been able to reach him for three days. Calm down. I haven't done anything to him except what he wanted. Poor Carl is currently asleep at my house. Is he asleep? What does that mean? What do you want from him? I don't want anything from him. As I mentioned earlier, he came to visit me and asked for something. He asked for a pair of eyes from me. What? He was greatly disappointed after losing his eyesight and couldn't see you for a long time, so he came to me and asked for a new pair of eyes. So you'd be able to see you again. Don't be ridiculous, Robert. Please don't do such a thing. Ah, if you had seen Carl in that state of collapse, you could never have refused him. I already accepted it anyways. I told him that I would give him a pair of eyes to see the woman I love, to see the woman he's married to. Wait, he loves me? Stop it, Robert. I'm married to Carl, and I love him. Stop using your obsession with me as an excuse to conduct absurd experiments on Carl. This guy's so ugly. I'm making up any excuses. Or I'm not making up any excuses. Carl and I had this conversation. Very openly, clearly expressed what he wanted. Now I will give him what he desires so much. What do you mean by that? I will give him the eyes he desires. Amy. Damn. 
still using the same needle. That is not sanitary. Oh. Oh yeah, I killed him. Yeah, I'm Carl. And you're dead. Bitch ass. Oh. So I just have to keep Oh god. Ugh. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I don't want to keep stabbing him. <laughs> I feel like that's the only thing I'm allowed to do right now. Stop! I don't like it. It's grossing me out. Oh, okay. Stabbed him for 20 times. Stop! I don't like this. Oh, crotch. What else do I do? Am I done? Am I done? Arg! Die, die! Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm murdering and I'm angry and it's gross. Stop it. Oh, God. I'm gonna be sick. I need to go downstairs. Get a glass of water. Amy! These are not real. None of this is real. Where the hell am I? I need to just go look in the mirror for a second. Amy? Uh, Amy. Couldn't have done this. Circling back to the beginning of the... Yeah, nice. Hello? Oh, and this is the part where I... I can't. I hate it. I hate it so much. I'll do that. So, so dramatic. So dramatic. Oh. Finish ending one. Unfinished ending. There's different endings? Man. Okay, well, that was interesting. Now, I, okay, I want you guys to play this game and let me know what ending you got. I'm not going to go back and try to get all the endings, but now that I know there's more endings and you guys have watched this, go see if you can go get a different ending. That'd be cool. This game's only like two or three dollars, so sweet. Anyways, um, happy spooky season. I've not been posting this month basically at all, but I'm going to be doing a lot more posts for Halloween season. So stay tuned for that. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Leave a comment down below of a game you want to see me play, and I will be sure to do that. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. As always, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will see you guys in the next one.